Hello everyone, this is HTS Gaska here. You guys know what's going on. It is more Heart of the Swarm campaign playthrough action. Thank you so much to everyone who's been liking, favoriting, commenting, subscribing, all that good stuff. You guys are the best. But uh, I'm going to be honest, you're not as good as the StarCraft 2 Heart of the Swarm campaign. Let's go ahead and continue on. Uh, go ahead and hop into the, the next mission. have launched a vessel from the dark side of Calder. We are still able to sense its presence, but time is running short. All right, this is a Roach Evolution mission. Let's go ahead and do that, see what this is about. One of your ships escaped. Then you need only await the Golden Armada. Your death will be swift. I'm sorry. For what? Slaughtering my people? For what I must do to you. <laughs> your friends on that ship can sense you. They know they left one behind. No. But they can't warp you to their ship, because I'm blocking them. No! No! But if I drop the veil... Do not warp me in, Templar! Do not! You let the other Protoss take her? She will be their death. Alright, during certain missions you will control a hero other than Kerrigan. Use their unique abilities to defeat your enemies. Ah, oh, but me and Kerrigan have been having some fun. I can kind of see why Jimmy likes her, man. She's got some uh, pretty good abilities, if you know what I mean. But uh, I guess in this mission we're not going to be using Kerrigan, something like that. But we shall see. We shall see if it is good, is as good as not having Kerrigan. And I'm kind of curious to see exactly how this mission goes. I think, yeah, I should be warping him in right about now. This ship contains many dangers. Follow my commands and hide in the shadows. You will consume and grow. Infest this ship and kill every last Protoss on board. Okay. Apparently we are playing as a larva. It is the little larva that could, man. Oh god, what is this? Now go and spawn your brood. All right, so it has an ability to take control of a unit. This vessel is bloated with life. Easy to find biomass. All right, let's see. I don't think I can use it just yet. Not on these things. But apparently the Protoss like to keep caged animals, too. I guess some things never change. Go ahead. Oh. A zealot. Use your... What was that noise? He's gone. Consume your host and move on. Oh, that was amazing. That was amazing. Wait, should I take over? A sentry. Hide in the steam vents until it passes. Oh my god, it's literally a sentry. Alright, cause the larva leap forward toward the targeted creature. Priority one established. All other priorities rescinded. Patrolling. All right, well, apparently sentries know how to talk, which is uh, it's a new thing for me. So I'm going to hide in the smoke. The sentry's going to be moving back and forth. And away! Oh, my God. He is so effing adorable. This this mission is no crazy. Zealots. Invade the Ursodon and crush them. All right, I will, I will indeed do that. Oh my god, I am a giant Ursodon. So the Protoss think they have a few infested animals. They have no idea what they're up against. Amazing! They definitely have stepped it up for this campaign, making lots of silly changes. I love it. For you to grow into a brood mother. I'm a little larva, short and stout. I'm guessing I have to go this way. Oh my god, I'm going through the pipes. Ah, apparently this is a safe place. 
stop here. This area is safe from prying eyes. Evolve. Grow. Okay, so... Now I'm turning into a brood mother, or Ni Niadra. I've got you now. How may I serve? All right, what are we supposed to be doing now? You are Niadra. This is your purpose. Spawn a brood and destroy the Protoss. Kill them all. I live to serve. All right, let's see. Oh, she poops them out. Kill these creatures. I can consume their biomass and use it to grow our brood. The Zerg has infiltrated our vessel. Warriors, destroy it. I heard you are a cleansing the brood. All right, I, I'm getting the hang of this. This is pretty awesome. This is pretty awesome. So basically, I can just keep spawning Zerglings out of my butt, which is quite the thing. And I get to eat all these animals over here, which makes me grow stronger, which means I can evolve. Oh, wait, no, not yet. Not yet, but you can see the number up here. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna eat all these. This is really what I'm primarily focused on, is eating all these animals to become amazing. And also, every time I poop out Zerglings, it like, it, it spawns creep or something, which is even cooler. Oh no, it doesn't spawn creep. But I definitely got creep from somewhere. Is it when I eat things? Is that how that works? Oh god, <laughs> they're trying to warp in cannons on the ship. One way to do it, I suppose. Or is it when I eat these things? Yep, when I eat them, they give me creep. All right, I can't evolve quite yet, but we are getting pretty close. Oh wait, you need to do... Why is that not working? Oh, they take two, okay. All right, we got it. Kill off this, let us continue. Can I even fit in there? I have grown too large to enter these vents, but my Zerglings will make it through. All right, fair enough. It kind of reminds me of Diablo 2 tunnels. That structure powers the shield. How may I serve? So we kill off the Psy broadcaster. The shield no longer blocks my path. Let us move forward. A strong energy emanates from this part of the ship. What is its purpose? I feel like we are about to find out. My purpose currently is to eat a bunch of animals, which I approve of. The energy, it is overwhelming. You found their warp drive. Destroy it and this vessel will never reach Shakuras. All right, killing off the warp drive it is. I guess they're gonna be running through here. Come on, you little guys, we can do it. We can do it. All right, well, we gotta kill off all this stuff. Can I, can I get over there from here? Can I like sneak through here? Oh no, I can't. I must kill the cannon first. If you're wondering, yes, it looks like it zoomed in a little bit. I think that's just how the mission is laid out. All right, kill that off. Should be the power generator. I'll destroy the warp drive myself. Oh, I see. Like, literally have to destroy it yourself. Thankfully, throwing darts at Protoss technology always seems to work. this countdown is but hopefully I get to where I'm going before <laughs> all right can I get in there yes I can Woo. The 
explosions have stopped. Wait, there is a disturbance in the chamber ahead. Emergency. Power failure detected. Awakening Protoss warriors from stasis. Alright, time to kill off some Protoss warriors, which I'm okay with. I mean, that's really not that many guys. This guy keeps spawning Zerglings. Oh, here they come. Take those guys out. Talk about a rude awakening, man. Can you imagine if you woke up with this many Zerglings in your base? Or I guess it'd be in your bedroom. It's time to evolve and expand your control over your brood, Niadra. Oh god, I'm looking terrifying. I can birth roaches now? What? God, why don't we always use Niadra? She is basically a mobile base. Exterminate the specimens. Do not allow the Zerg to consume them. Kill their warriors. I must have that biomass. Gotta get that biomass. I feel like these guys are gonna do fine. She can just run around and eat things. Really, I just gotta free up supply for more roaches anyway. Although, having the Zerglings is kind of nice, but. Oh, that was a Psy Storm. Okay. Oops, I made some Zerglings. That's fine. Considering that there's really no limit on the amount of stuff you can make. So, this is this is all fun at this point. Alright, scoop out another roach. About another approach. That Archon's making my job so much better. How may I serve? All right. Oh, they have Immortals now. Might need to be careful on the amount of roaches I get. I ah, who am I kidding? Roaches are so good. Alright, roaches will be able to handle that one quite easily. Apparently, my guys get life regeneration too, which is quite nice. I made a couple of Zerglings to absorb some of that damage. Oh my god, there's a lot more units in here too that I can eat. A lot more, oh my god. So many. Am I going to be able to evolve yet? How much do I need? 150 again. You must evolve. Grow stronger. The final battle approaches. Yeah, they have so many like custom skins now for these queens. Look at that. God, this guy's amazing. Oh, I can spawn Hydralisks now. Apparently a lot of Hydralisks. That is so many Hydras. All right, where am I supposed to go is the real question. It says the final battle is ahead. Am I, am I doing, oh wait, I think it's over here. I think we gotta kill this little door. Vent access. All right, I'm guessing you're too fat and you can't fit through there. Hey, what do you guys think you're doing? That's not cool. The Ersodon is mine. Come, beast. We have Protoss to destroy. All right, so can you do anything? Consume host. No, let's keep it alive for now. Let's keep it alive. He is pretty awesome. We'll eat all the smaller guys. Protoss are fortifying the bridge. Prepare your forces. Oh, my forces are prepared. I have so many Hydralisks. Alright, that is that is actually quite a bit of stuff. Let's just go ahead and jump right in there. Or not. The ship has taken us as far as it can. Prepare the escape pods. Destroy the pods before they launch. The Protoss must not reach Shakuras. I agree. They they mustn't. God, they're getting pretty close to launching, though. Strike now. We must buy our brother's time. No, we must kill. Kill the escape pods. Oh, God, they have a lot of HP. Okay, kill off these units first. They prepare more escape pods. Destroy them. I fear no. I feel like Hydralists are definitely the way to go right now. 
As long as they don't have any uh, Colossus or something, I think we're gonna be fine. All right, definitely gotta kill that one off. Get even more Hydras up in here. All right, we are not going up there. That's actually good that they force fielded that. We will not go quietly into the void. All right, Zergling's actually helping out a little bit, but I don't think anything beats Hydras. All right, I think we can kill off this one easily. That one actually did get pretty close, though. Gotta be careful. Oh, well, actually having everyone help out would be nice. All right, just keep spawning more Hydras. Hydras really have, like, the highest DPS. So I feel like that is definitely the way to go. As long as everyone's contributing, which they're not. Oh, God, I've left units behind everywhere. All right, kill this thing. Kill that thing immediately. All right, I think we got all of those. We will never be defeated. We give our lives for the cover. Yes. Ooh, with a fatty smack talk. The hunt continues. Without Nothing like smack talk from a Zerg, man. That's just intense. Basically, I'm just going to sit here. Oh, no! Oh, God, I wasn't paying attention. Oh, whoops. Uh, well, we'll just go ahead and load that last checkpoint, pretend that that never happened. I, uh, okay, look, guys. I thought the mission was over, so I was looking at something else, and the Zerg bug died. Which really, I feel like, is the Zerg's fault for being weak. It is indeed the Zerg's fault for being weak. It is not my fault. I had nothing to do with it. I wanted to see this beautiful loading screen again. And that's what I'm sticking with. That, I'm sticking to it. I'm sticking to my guns. And we don't gotta talk about it. Oh god, it put me all the way back here. Alright, whatever. Whatever, guys. Doesn't even matter. Oh god, she's taking damage again. Just gotta jump and stunt those guys, man. The ship has taken us as far as it can. Prepare the escape pods. Destroy the pods before they launch. The Protoss must not reach Shakuras. All right, well, at least this time I'm not going to be leaving units behind. Because it definitely does not hotkey them right away when you spawn additional units. So just, uh, just a pro tip. Anything hidden over here? Strike now. We must buy our brother's time. We must buy our brother's time. Yeah, you can't select them till they're, uh, till they're hatched. That's why it's, that's why it's not working out so good. no enemy, for the color is my strength. I'm just gonna make unlimited units, but this mission is freaking awesome. Our time has come. Guide my room. Come on, give me some more hydralisks. The roaches are kinda nice to have just because they absorb damage, but. Alright, they're not gonna let me go that way. That that is a fact. We just gotta be careful with Niadra. This did not go well last time. I think we're a little bit quicker this time though. That is a bonus. Let's kill this off, guys. I'm working on it. Don't you? Don't you fuss none. It's not like I'd ever get you killed or something. That that definitely never happened. I don't know what you guys are talking about. All right, I think I think we're gonna be okay. Oh god, they're killing my units pretty quick though. Yes, please kill this one before I lose. Alright, so we killed the escape pods. Now I have to kill all of the Protoss. There's 10 remaining. We will never be defeated. We give our lives for the color. Yes, you will. I definitely love that smack talk, though. I'm going to be honest. It's almost worth coming back here just for the smack talk. Oh, that storm was pretty good. I will, I will give him that. Not bad of a side storm there. But they ain't got nothing with my mobile base. All right, let's see how many we got left. Zero. Zero remaining. Also, we took over their ship. The Protoss are no more, my queen. My queen, can you hear me? We are alone. 
Oh, Kerrigan just leaving her. The Queen of Blades has given us one purpose. To destroy the Protoss. We will be prepared. We will serve again. The one nice thing about being Zerg and being the Queen of Blades is that you can just, like, abandon people and they're like, alright, well, we're gonna build up a base for whenever you come back. So, uh, she has made a loyal servant today, which is pretty dope. I'm actually quite enjoying this. You, you guys know me. I'm not, like, the biggest Zerg fan. I'm more of a Protoss guy, but I gotta say, they have done an outstanding job on these missions. Definitely, definitely a lot of fun. A lot of stuff that uh, we haven't seen before. There's no turning back now. I do not understand. The Protoss will never forgive what I've done here. If my becoming human again eased their fears, well, I've given them new reasons to be afraid. But I'm not going to wait for them to come after me. I'll strike first. Man, Kerrigan making enemies to everywhere! Able to travel to another world at your command. Alright, well, let's have a little bit of a chit-chat. It is done. The Golden Armada will never know we were here. I am glad that Protoss is no longer aboard our Leviathan. Her psionic presence was disturbing. She died bravely, trying to save her friends. Why do you care how the Protoss died? I will kill anyone in my way. That doesn't mean I enjoy it. Even Arcturus Mengsk, my queen? Will his death bring you no joy? Stop talking, Isha. Oh snap! Let's go ahead and go to the evolution pit. See if we unlocked any uh, any cute new units. Oh, Abathur, what is up, my man? Placed parasite into Protoss host. Yes. What about it? Clever, lateral thinking. Protoss not able to be infested, but can still be host to foreign organism. Origins of parasite unknown. I made it, Abathur. You're not the only one who can spin sequences. Revelation I made it, Abathur. You're not the only work. one who can spin sequences. I made it, Abathur. Oh no, we're getting the looping the Kerrigan now. Why does this always happen to I me? I made it, Abathur. You're not the only one who can spin sequences. Oh god, we, if you guys just want to listen to Kerrigan for an hour, we You're now have the, the ability to do that. Sequences. All right, well, uh, I'll go ahead and end the video here so we don't have to listen to Kerrigan for an hour and a half uh, repeating the same phrase. It must just be a bug in my files which randomly happens because this actually happened in the uh, in, in Wings of Liberty. So my computer's just a little bit special. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time. You're not the only one who can spin sequences. You're not the only one who can spin sequences.